Hi guys, in this tutorial, I'll demonstrate how you evaluate the integral of something like, like this one here. So this came as a request from a student of mine. So she wanted me to work out uh, number six, which is this one here. So how do you work it out? Well, this is tricky and when you look at it, you're trying to use u substitution and you quickly observe that it won't actually work out. Now then, how do you approach it? Well, we're going to use a trick here. It's going to be very, very basic really. What I'm going to do here is, we'll focus on the top for now. And what we'll do is that we want to make the top as similar to the numerator as, to, to the denominator as possible. So what we're going to do is we're going to add e to the x. We're going to literally add this here. So that we have one plus e to the x. But we're not to say we can't, just add something like that it's going to be mathematically wrong so we're going to add it and then we're going to quickly subtract it so we're going to have plus e to the x minus e to the x so this is what our expression now is then of course we have dx we know to say from a mathematical point of view this is just the same as zero because these are going to subtract out now having done that we're going to write this into two separate expressions or fractions in one part, we're going to have 1 plus e to the x over 1 plus e to the x, then minus the second part, we're going to have e to the x over 1 plus e to the x, then dx. You know to say you can easily combine these two, it will take you back to that, simplify, and it will still simplify to that expression. So this is okay. So at this point, we're going to break it into two separate integrals. 1 plus e to the x over 1 plus e to the x dx, then minus this side, e to the x over 1 plus e to the x dx. Of course, this is just 1, and then the integral of dx is going to just be x there, minus this side. Here we have a little bit of work to do. e to the x dx. So to work out this integral, we're going to now use u substitution. So say let u be equals to 1 plus e to the x. So of course we see that du will be equals to du dx, that is. This will be equals to literally just e to the x. Of course, this implies that dx will be equals to du over e to the x. So when we substitute, now our answer is going to be x minus the integral of, so we had e to the x on top over, the denominator is what we said u is going to be, and then where there's dx, we'll plug in that. It's going to be du over e to the x. The e to the x will cancel with that, leaving us with x, the integral of 1 over u, du. And this integral here, we know what the integral of 1 over u is. With respect to u, of course, this is just going to be lean u of course with modulus there then plus c so of course now we bring back what u is so this is now lean let's check what u is 1 plus e to the x so you have 1 plus e to the x then plus c so this is what the integral of 1 over 1 plus e to the x with respect to x so this is what it is all right guys hope you found this helpful see you guys in the next tutorial